bag fell. <laughs> Let you get in there between there and get it. You making all that mess. That's probably who made that mess over there at the fitness center. When Come on now, I got you on camera, so show some action. I know you, you showed it a few minutes ago. Yeah, I'm talking to you. Yes, I am. Oh, this is boring. They're not doing anything. I know they're anything. not doing nothing now. Oh man. Let me see. Well, take. Oh, he's trying to get in there. <laughs> that was action. You should have seen that. He's trying to get in the watch. See, trying to get that bag. <laughs> there, there you go, man. There you go. Look at it. Oh my gosh, look at that. <clears throat> they just making a mess. Oh, here's the third one. They know food. Yeah, oh, four of them. The two females, and here come the two males. <laughs> Hey guys, I have a weekly grocery haul that I got from Walmart. So if you guys want to see what's what came out of these empty bags, I should say, then keep on watching. Okay, this is just some of the stuff, most of the stuff I should say, that we picked up and I laid it out as best I can. And then I have some items on the other side of the counters. So this is my kitchen table. So we're going to first start off here. We have some Amy's. Uh, what is this? Enchiladas. I picked up two of those. And I'm pretty sure that whoever eats this is going to love it because I can't eat it. Then we have some Texas toast. Ooh, delicious with cheese. Texas toast. We can't get the garlic, but um, Texas toast with cheese is good enough. Then I got a can of organic soup, and this is the lentil vegetable soup. I like to put this in my uh, regular beans and make it, you know, into a nice, um, you know, thicker soup. And then we have some Friday's chicken wings. So I guess they'll be eating this on Fridays. <laughs> then we have some C&H sugar. Got two of the fettuccine Alfredo with chicken broccoli entrees. We've got some fillets, some fish fillets, 10 in a pack there. Got a pizza, pepperoni pizza by Red Baron. Over here is some cookies. These are uh, Nan Nantucket dark chocolate cookies. These should be tasty. And then I've got a berry medley fruit that I can put in, you know, make a smoothie out of. This is my first time buying a pack of these and uh, I'm going to start making some smoothies when I can, but I just picked up just this one pack just to try it and see how it is. Over here is a box of banquet fried chicken. We used to get this a lot back in the day. And I think they stopped making it or they changed their packaging because it looks quite different. So I got one box of those. We have Marie Callender's beef and broccoli bowl there. Got some Cheez-Its for a snack. Got two bags of the fire roasted steak fajitas. Two bags of those. And you pretty much, you know, you could put this in the oven or you can put it in your skillet and fry it up. Maybe add some fry, uh, fried eggs, scrambled eggs, potatoes, or anything. Got a extra virgin olive oil, because I ran out and I can't go without having that. Then I picked up, I think there's one or two bags of sweet potato fries. If you guys have never tried these, these are very good. I like them. I just put them in the oven at 400 or 420 no not 420 410 degrees sometimes and uh, when they come out i just sprinkle them sometimes i'll add a little cinnamon to mine or sometimes i'll add a little um seasoning to it then we have some seasoned french fries got a bag of those over here got some snacks m m candy peanut Got some cooking oil, and we get the Smart Balance. Got some lemonade, Simply Lemonade, this is good. And a bag of Werther's candy, but this is the beef 
pot roast um, entree. Got some Ritz crackers. Mmm, yum, yum. Got some sweet tea, and that's the pure leaf kind. Uh, Alfredo fettuccine entree. Got some wavy potato chips, Lay's, party size. Got a big bag of the peppermints. We like to suck on peppermints in this house, so lots of peppermint going on. We put some in the car, <laughs> put some in our bedrooms, living room. <laughs> My purse, I mean, peppermints are everywhere. <laughs> then we got the Quaker Simply Granola. Ooh, Huppy must have picked this up. He didn't know I like these myself. He should have got me one. But anyway, these are really good. I'm pretty sure he'll probably have milk with his. But for me, I would probably eat them plain because I don't like milk. Then picked up a, these are cookies. And these are like buttery cookies by Chessman, called Chessman. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of this, but it has a very interesting package. And it's, okay, and then we got a thing of milk, which I need to put in the refrigerator right now. Okay, over here on this counter, I just picked up some oranges. Because for me, I'm going to be eating fruit, 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 along with my other meals. Picked up some apples, a few of those. One onion. Picked up some gum, juicy fruit. And these things here, these vitamins, we have started trying these. This is an immune booster, a 24-hour um, that has vitamin C that helps support your immune system and it has 1000 milligrams of ester c and it has the vitamin d plus zinc with elderberry ignitia supports upper respiratory health and it has some other vitamins in here um i don't know if you guys want to take a screenshot of this this is supposed to help you know boost up your immune system and we've been taking these and let me tell you about these vitamins guys these are big horse pills you take two a day they are very very big so if you do try these make sure you open your throat wide <laughs> and I mean swallow okay but they're very good for you so if you want to take a screenshot of that and that's what we're doing to help boost our immune system as well as you know these fruits here these are some little protein little snackers has apples um, Apples or pears, I'm not sure what that is. Um, pretzels. And over here, this one has the cheese. And the red apple. So, two of those. Then I pack, picked up two packs of red beans so I can make my weekly beans. That's my protein. Then I have some hazelnut coffee creamer. Some Idaho spudnut, not spudnut, but Idaho potatoes, mashed potatoes in the box. Then I have some celery, a thing of celery, a box of regular crackers, and some bounty napkins. And we get the large size here. Let me see what this is. There's three, no, 200 of these in here, so that goes a long way so i forgot here's some miscellaneous things we like to put these in our dispensers and um, use them for when we're washing our hands and we have some men's degree deodorant four of those and they're about to fall some vaseline we use a lot of vaseline in this house so as you can see there's what one, two, three, four, five, <laughs> five things of Vaseline, some cabbage, which I didn't show on the other side, and some, what is this, cucumbers. Well, that's about it. I think that's all we picked up, guys. So thank you guys so much for watching, and you guys have a blessed day, and I will see you next time in my next video. Bye.